The confirmation of Neera Tondon to lead the Office of Management and Budget is on the brink of collapse after four key Republicans announced Monday that they will vote against her nomination, citing her past social media behavior. Tondon's nomination in the evenly split Senate was jeopardized late last week when Democratic Senator Joe Manchin of West Virginia said he would not support her, making her confirmation dependent on attracting at least one Republican vote. But two Republicans who were viewed as potential swing votes, sends. Susan Collins of Maine and Mitt Romney of Utah, declared Monday they will not support her. Two others, Senator Rob Portman, an Ohio Republican, and Senator Toomey, a Pennsylvania Republican, also announced they would not vote for Tondon. The White House has publicly defended Tondon's nomination, but sources have told CNN talks are underway about possible replacements. In a statement, Collins cited Tondon's past actions that she says demonstrated animosity and said the OM nominee does not have the experience nor the temperament to lead the office. Congress has to be able to trust the OM director to make countless decisions in an impartial manner, carrying out the letter of the law and congressional intent, Collins said. Neera Tondon has neither the experience nor the temperament to lead this critical agency. Her past actions have demonstrated exactly the kind of animosity that President Biden has pledged to transcend. Collins continued that Tondon's deletion of tweets before her confirmation was announced raises concerns about her commitment to transparency. A spokeswoman for Romney said he could not support Tondon and what he believes to be her divisiveness. Senator Romney has been critical of extreme rhetoric from prior nominees, and this is consistent with that position. He believes it's hard to return to comedy and respect with a nominee who has issued a thousand mean tweets, Romney's press secretary Ariel Muller said in a statement. When President Biden announced his intention to nominate Ms. Tondon as OM director, I expressed concern and urged him to reconsider. As a former OM director, I know that the OM director has to be able to work productively with members of Congress on both sides of the aisle, Portman said, pointing to Tondon's past tweets and public statements. He added, while the president has the right to choose his own cabinet, and thus far I have supported all of this administration's nominees, I will not be supporting the confirmation of Ms. Tondon. Senator Toomey will oppose Neera Tondon's nomination, Toomey's spokesperson Bill Jaffe told CNN. Democrats hold the Senate by a 50-50 margin, and Manchin's announcement was seen as devastating for her chances. One senior Democratic senator involved in discussions about Tondon's nomination believes there's virtually no path to confirm her to the position.